23 ABC's digital update is brought to you by West Medical. I'm Mike Hart. Here's a look at what we're following on this Tuesday. This morning, funeral services will be held for Boulder Police Officer Eric Talley, who lost his life in that mass shooting last week. Talley was the first officer to arrive at the grocery store in Boulder, where a gunman walked in and opened fire, killing 10 people. A funeral mass was held Monday for Talley, an 11-year veteran of the Boulder PD. He leaves behind a wife and seven children. Today's public funeral begins at 10 o'clock our time. The First Lady will be in Kern County tomorrow. Dr. Jill Biden planning to head to Delano and take part in the Day of Action at the 40 Acres property during Cesar Chavez Day. It will be Dr. Jill Biden's first trip to the Central Valley. 23 ABC will have full coverage of her day, including her touchdown at Meadows Field and participation at 40 Acres, along with Governor Gavin Newsom. Meantime, COVID vaccinations in Kern County are expanding. Public Health saying that everyone in Kern County is eligible to get vaccinated except for six zip codes. Most of the county fits into the state's new definition of being a, quote, vulnerable community. The state announced that they were withholding about 40 percent of the vaccines they get for these communities. The Kern County Public Health website has a breakdown so you can schedule an appointment. Just go there at kernpublichealth.com. Let's bring in Callan Hobbin right now and in for Elena for a look at your Tuesday forecast. Yeah, taking a look outside, we're going to have a warm and sunny day today. We're going to see a temperature of around 79 degrees, so definitely warm out there. And that's actually going to heat up even more tomorrow. We're going to hit around 85 degrees tomorrow. And then for Thursday and Friday, we're in those upper 80s, 88 and 89 degrees, so almost to 90 degrees. So it's going to be a warm one out there. As we head into the weekend, that temperature will drop back down into the mid 80s, though. We'll be at 86 degrees on Saturday, and then we'll cool down even a little bit more. We'll be at 80 on Sunday, and then we're dropping back down into those upper 70s on Monday as we head into next week. There's going to be some slightly windy conditions and cloud coverage as well, but we will still have those sunny skies. Now, as for our mountain communities, we're going to be at 74 degrees today for Kern River Valley, 63 for Tehachapi and Fraser Park, and we still have that sunshine all the way through the weekend. We'll hit around the 80s on Thursday and Friday in Kern River Valley, and then we'll warm up to those lower and mid 70s for Tehachapi and Fraser Park on Thursday and Friday as well. And then heading into those into the weekend, those temperatures will begin to drop. We'll be at 76 for Kern River Valley on Sunday, mid 60s for Tehachapi and Fraser Park, and then Kern River Valley drops back into the 60s and then into the 50s for Tehachapi and Fraser park on monday that's a look at just some of the stories we're following at this hour and you can find breaking news weather and traffic anytime you need it anywhere just download our free mobile and tablet apps have a great day